Привет! And welcome to Russian with Dasha. Why am I wearing a towel? Well, in this video you are going to learn about the Russian banya. I'm going to show you two private banyas that my family members have in their country houses. Follow me. The banya is the traditional Russian spa. Banya. For the Russians, it is a place to relax, as well as to spend time with family and friends, talking about Dostoevsky, and to cleanse the soul and heal the body. Visiting Banya is good for your health and skin. It makes your immune system stronger and reduces stress. Many Russians have a private banya for the family in their country houses, in a small wooden hut. Country house, dacha. In this video you are going to see two different banyas. The first one is the smaller one, and the second one is more fancy one. It has the kitchen and some rooms upstairs. A classic Russian banya is heated with firewood. Usually there are at least three rooms. A space that serves as a dressing room and resting area. It is called predbannik. The second room has the shower. Sometimes there is also a swimming pool. The shower room, dushivaya, swimming pool, Bassein. The third space is the sauna, in which you can sit or lay on the benches. In Russian it is called Parnaya. You should get naked when you go to Banya. You can cover yourself with a piece of cloth or a towel to feel more comfortable. Always wear a felt hat to protect your hair. It regulates your head's temperature. That's why it is very important, even if it looks funny. Take a shower first and then move on to the steam sauna. Parnaya. When you get inside, the temperature can be pretty high, from 80 to 100 degrees. So make sure you don't overheat yourself. We add some water onto the stones, which increases humidity and temperature. Steam, par, humidity, влажность. Sit there for a couple of minutes and breathe. When leaving the sauna, you should take another shower. Then you can go to the swimming pool or throw on yourself a bucket of cold water. In the country houses, dacha. It is common to walk right out of the steam room and jump into the snow or pond. To jump into the snow, прыгнуть в снег. Jump into the pond, прыгнуть в пруд. Then you can go back to Parnaya. When you have done this ritual several times, you can go to the rest area. Предбанник. Do not drink cold water, beer or vodka between turns. Drink warm herbal tea with honey instead. It stops your body temperature from dropping and hydrates you. Honey. Мёд. Herbal tea. Травяной чай. Tea called Blooming Sally. Ivan. Чай. Mountain tea. Горный чай. Do you know what venik is? Leafy branches bound together. Usually they are from birch or oak trees. A gentle lashing with the venik is good for your skin. It relaxes your muscles and makes your skin smooth. In public banya, there is a special person who is responsible for this ritual called банщик. I love when we use current branches. Смородиновые ветки. They have very pleasant aroma. У них очень приятный 
Aramat. When you come to Russia, you should definitely go to Banya. Relax and enjoy your time in Russia. In the next videos, you are going to learn how to introduce yourself and revise some alphabet.